Thank you for taking the time to watch this brief introduction to ESCO's Force Convection Laboratory Incubators. These new incubators from ESCO are available in a wide range of sizes and feature microprocessor PID-based control systems with a wide range of program, data logging, and alarm functions. The ESCO incubator has a fully featured controller. I'd like to talk about some of the uh, uh, functions and uh, display features and operations. First, we have uh, three LEDs on the left, heat, alarm, and program. We have two temperature displays, the um, actual temperature and the uh, set point temperature. The uh, displays are uh, real large and uh, easy to read even from uh, across the room. We have a program key. This controls uh, start, pause and stop. When the uh, incubator is in program mode, we have a menu key to enter the menu for setting alarms, data logging, service and other functions. Set temperature key, up, down. Moving on to the right, we have a mains power switch, makes it easy to turn the um, incubator off. We have a independent over temperature thermostat. This is uh, classified according to class 3.1 according to DIN 12880. It's real easy to adjust with a coin. It's now set at 50. I'm going to turn it down. You see that uh, when I turn it down, the uh, LED, red LED here lights up to indicate that uh, the incubator is in a over temperature condition. This is uh, independent and uh, does not depend on the microprocessor control, so it offers a measure of safety. Last but not least, we have um, a exhaust vent adjuster. It's real easy to operate. By adjusting the exhaust vent, one can regulate the air exchange rate in the incubator, which uh, may be useful for different applications. Chamber construction, we have a gravity assisted door handle that's really easy to operate, it just uh, opens this way. We have two point uh, chamber seal and outer door gasket and uh, an inner gasket. The uh, inner door opens real easily this way. Within the chamber, notice the uh, fan for force convection at the rear, covered by a, a baffle plate that helps to distribute air uh, for best uniformity within the chamber. In this design, air enters uh, from the base of the chamber, is uh, preheated uh, through what we refer to as a preheat zone at the bottom and the left and the right. The preheated air then enters the chamber through vents on the left and the right, and the uh, air is then recirculated within the chamber for good uniformity and low fluctuation. Notice in this design, we do not have heaters directly present in the chamber. This helps to improve user safety and also helps us with uh, uh, achieving a very good uh, temperature fluctuation and uh, variation. The uh, chamber is also very easy to clean. Notice the uh, all rounded corners um, on the four, four corners. Shelving design, uh, ergonomic. The uh, shelf uh, has a sort of building handle over here. When you pull it out, it's uh, anti-tip design. Last but not least, uh, we have a uh, real nifty uh, glass door function that uh, just uh, pulls open for easy cleaning. Real easy to uh, assemble back. ESCO incubators are coated with um, isocyte coating. This coating eliminates 99.9% uh, .9 of surface bacteria within 24 hours of exposure and provides a measure of built-in protection. These incubators are available in a wide range of sizes with a wide range of options and accessories. For more information or to speak with a local sales representative, please visit our website at uh, www.escoglobal.com. Thank you.